The Red Cross is issuing a warning about a national blood shortage. It's now impacting patients in hospitals right here on the West Coast. The family of one little girl says that she is not getting all of the blood that she needs to treat a rare disorder. Uh, tonight, her six-year-old cousin is putting out a plea for help. King 5's Eric Wilkinson shares his wish this holiday season. You can sense the excitement in Caleb Stone's Christmas carols with the holiday less than two weeks away. Caleb, what are you asking Santa Claus for for Christmas this year? A racetrack around the earth. <laughs> so I could always be driving, you know. A close second, however, is a priceless gift for his four-year-old cousin, Jade. It really makes the blood different. And that's a problem. Yeah. Jade was born with a rare blood disorder called thalassemia, which necessitates a blood transfusion every 21 days. The family says Jade's doctors in California told her this week she can only get half the amount of blood she needs. My sister doesn't sleep at night hoping that there will be enough blood at the next transfusion, and I realize there's lots of people who are um, sleepless at night thinking about the same thing. All I want for Christmas is my So Caleb decided to put together this little public service announcement on Facebook. Please donate blood. Because the refrigerators aren't full, so we all get them full. Full of what? Full of blood. The Red Cross says the nationwide demand for blood is up 12%, while donor turnout is down 10%. Supply is the lowest it's been in a decade. Caleb's mom, Jessica, hoped his musical PSA would inspire people to donate blood to help her niece. She didn't realize how many others are out there in need until she got a message from an old friend. I just wanted you to know that that post was really impactful um, because my daughter was recently diagnosed with cancer and we're also needing blood transfusions. So as Caleb plans his holiday wish list, he'd like you to think about his cousin and all the others out there as you plan yours. We always think about what's on our shopping list at this time of year. Um, and we forget to realize that the most valuable gift that we can give is the gift of life. <laughs> In Bellingham, Eric Wilkinson, King 5 News.